need to add this to the first of the video. I don't, the more y'all learn me, that y'all learn how much I enjoy projects. So y'all have absolutely no idea how much this YouTube channel would be like a dream come true. Cause got all these projects built or not built, bought ideas. So if this works, it's freaking amazing. So if y'all help me out, tell your buddies, whatever needs to be done, I don't know, just, but here you go. This is a video that I've just been wanting to make, kind of explaining what I'm going to be building on the channel. Uh, I know y'all probably don't care, but today is the first day I've come out and looked around. And of course, there's millions of things I can do, but today I didn't have to do nothing. I finally got away from public mechanic work. So I'm kind of slowing down, just doing some stuff for the channel. Trying to, I was going to get a microphone and all this stuff to make the video better. We're getting there, but uh, I know some channels might call a build, you know, putting a lift or something on. So I've got like some legit stuff and that's what I, what I wanted to show you. Uh, let's just see, you gotta go to different shops, but this is my squatted Jeep stuff. I got some air fresheners, headlights, wheel lights, some goofy colored paint. Uh, got some Heim joints for my green Jeep. I know y'all saw that. Uh, trying to remember, that's some, I got four sets of rock lights for the squatted Jeep. So that's gonna be a, that's gonna be a hilarious build. Uh, walk over here. Got these axles are going in a Jeep. I'll show you in just a second. This is a transfer case I built. It's got the wide chain kit. It's got 1350 U joints. Got some spicers for that. 456 for these. Oh Lord. I'm trying to think. I got that one Jeep that I want to re gear. I just told you that. Uh, got a used set of lockers and 456. That's another build. Oh, that's my, I think y'all already seen this stuff before, but that's, uh, got a fire going. My V8 to AW4. So that's that. Let me walk outside and show you some of, some of these up here. Show girl. That's the kind of stuff I used to build before I had YouTube, but I got some better, better stuff on the way. So just random stuff. And that's what's so cool about YouTube. If you don't care about a video, don't watch it. Just whatever. So that's my spray rig. That's definitely redneck. Oh, uh, it's got a bunch of electric or batteries. And then I got an inverter and that's going to get redone and not trying to get too technical on all these because it's going to be a long video if I do. This one, I've had it since I was 13. It's getting manual windows. This is a Renix Comanche. Nothing wrong with it, but I want to see how hard it is to convert to new style. Uh, this Jeep just showed you it's getting the axles. I'm trying to think WJ knuckles, brakes, a few more things. So that's one project. Oh, the record Jeep. I'm pretty sure y'all have saw this by now. It unfortunately, I think the fuel pump went out. So I don't know if I'm going to build a new one or change the fuel pump. Uh, let's go inside the shop here. Uh, this shop has got to get organized. That's not for the channel. This is just the old daily driver. Uh, let's see. Weasel through here. Like this, well, I got to pull the cover off that. This Jeep, that's the one I put a post on Facebook. I built it from the ground up like, well, I don't know if GoPro will let you see. Oh, let me put my flashlight out. Maybe this will work. Everything is paint to match. All the axles are clear coat. So that's a pretty freaking cool Jeep. I'm still working on it. Just painting the hood. Uh, I'll pull a cover off this. I think y'all get the concept. I built the bumper, painted it. Front end conversion in inside. It's all brand new. This is something I did like six, seven years ago. Just kind of a, like I said, I just enjoy builds. And this is gonna be a part right to clip. These axles, uh, crap. Nine inch, 35 spline Yukon, four, 540 or 537 gears. WJ brakes, got it trussed. Uh, 1350 stuff and that's that transfer case. I just showed you. That's what this is for uh, High pinion 44 
got reed knuckles, all new brakes, heim joint steering, uh, what do you call it, crossover. Same, well, both of these have true tracks. And like I said, I think they're 540 gears. So I've got them that I want to put them in the Jeep I'm fixing to show you, I think. But I hadn't made up my mind yet. I decided not to confuse y'all, so I walked back here. And what it is, is this body style, WK, whatever. I've never seen one with more than like a, I don't know, leveling kit. So I'm gonna straight axle swap it. And like, well, walk over. You know, this these are obvious, y'all saw them. Uh, that's a truck. I know that probably won't go on the channel. I built it, well, from the ground up. This is a 5'9", that's a 5'9". So that's a pretty cool build I did years ago. And it's just endless stuff. I mean, just random. All living Jeeps through there. Those are all builds, but let me walk back in here, I'll show you some stuff. You can see I keep shelves full of wheel spacers, wheel adapters, all the rough country shocks, boots. So that's that stuff. GoPro may not like this lighting. Oh, uh, Iron Rock, Iron Man, Fab, Off-Road, I can't even remember. Uh, bought that to go under the white Jeep I just showed you, but the more I thought about it, that's going under a Cherokee because that's what it's designed for. So, oh, let's see. Slip yoke eliminator, eliminator, sets of shocks. Oh, that's a, a, a ZJ long arm kit. I'm putting a ZJ long arm kit under the rear of a Cherokee with a ZJ rear end. I wanna see if I can make it where like anybody could do it, but we'll have to get there. Uh, now y'all probably can't see. Got a set of Fox coilovers. Uh, honestly, I don't even remember what's in them boxes. Heavy. Oh, a turbo kit. That's what I think I've already told you my daily. It's getting a turbo on it. That's a project. Uh, got RCVs, keep them CVs in stock. Headlights, uh, triple triple aluminum radiator. I think that's a rock auto box, just full of randomness. But so got coilovers. All this stuff's already bought, paid for. So just gotta get time. Got a system that is going in that Jeep. And let's see if there's anything I'm missing. We may do something with that thing. I don't know. Got scooters. I know I'm forgetting a lot of stuff, but talking so much I can't remember what I said. Go across the road and show you some of the projects I've got picked out. As junky as it is, that's my daily. And that's the one I'm getting a turbo on. And well, I'll probably show you the intake. It's, I don't care for how fast it goes. I just want, when you pull out on the highway or whatever, it just goes. So after we learn what we're doing, check out my custom intake. Go straight in, cap the PCV off. So that's a project. We'll do it another day. We'll run out here in the junkyard and show you something. I've got all these bill or LS based projects bought, but just haven't had time to do nothing. So that's why I'm so excited for. Hopefully, YouTube will let me do something. Bought this one, had a built 5.3, got it pulled out. full drive with a running issue so it'll it'll probably get built up uh, that one's got a 5.3 I don't think nothing's wrong with it that one had a 6.0 I pulled it out that one had a Duramax and I might try to put a Duramax in one so that one's got a 6.0 it's good it's a wreck so got it do something with 4L80 got a two-wheel drive full drive so still got all these Jeeps to do something with. But I'm gonna go over there and show you some of the other fields. Probably won't believe me, but we literally just started today building a 5.0 stroker. Not a 4.6 or 4.7, it's a 5.0. So that's getting filmed like currently. He's hollering at me, hold on. Well, this is a different video, so I'm gonna film a different video on a different. You don't have a. So, walk in here. 
And I guess while I'm on this video, I'll video video the other video. Video and you video and me. Video. video. Yeah, video you video and me. I think that's how that works. This is confusing. I'll, hold up. <laughs> so, like I said, the channel's still new. So, all these projects and whatever, I don't know. It's all a gamble. See what people like. But this one, I picked it up. Let's the camera down. It's, it's me. But it's two wheel drive. So, that naturally has to be fixed. It's still a used Jeep. But as you can tell, the clear coat's perfect. Uh, inside's gotta be worked on, whatever. That's on the to-do list. I'll probably get Justin to build a motor, honestly, as much as that Jeep's be worth, but it's gonna be getting converted to four-wheel drive, and I know that's pretty like a basic build, but people have that. I'll, well, run over here. That's what I was gonna say. Oh! I'm gonna start out with a more basic build because the channel is the least amount of people that'll ever see it. So as the channel gets bigger, we'll do bigger and better builds, but it only makes sense. It's just uh, kind of how things work. Hold on. This Jeep is nothing to brag about, but it just needs a motor and finish the header panel and I think paint those two and I mean it's just a basic build but I want to just I need another Cherokee to daily drive so that's on that list let's see oh uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these but this one I know it looks run down but that iron rock kit or iron man whatever it was I think that's the one I got picked out for it so that's a project oh uh, let's see Oh, I still need one to uh, the ZJ long arm kit. So maybe finish this one. It's a classic. I don't even know what's wrong with it, honestly. Or that green one right down there. Man, I don't know. They're so freaking that that maybe that's the red one I had picked out. Can't remember. But we'll keep walking down here. I've got I got so many ideas in my head. I'm getting excited and can't even talk. I've got enough Comanches to last me. Who knows how long, but. Obviously, we'll do something cool with Comanches. I haven't really like specifically planned anything out yet, but LS, I don't want to do an off-road build with one. I don't know, but you can see, I mean, all these are very buildable. Oh, uh, probably nobody will care about this, but this is a mint, like 70,000 mile one owner truck. I might restore it. That is not mine. Hey, there's a Woody. I forgot I even had that thing. Oh, uh, this is the one. Oh, uh, I want it to be a sleeper. So that one will probably get some built LS motor. And I don't know, but. Yeah. Uh, five nine there. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Let's see, there's the Woody. I mean, I still wanna do some ZJ and WJ. I know people's like, loves the Cherokees, but I still like them all, you know, kind of neutral to whatever there, but. I appreciate y'all watching if you made it this far just kind of wanted to show you that i'm not just going to be a basic build i mean you can imagine i mean if i didn't work any longer how long this stuff will take so gonna be some good stuff just hang around tell your buddies all this all that nonsense stuff so thank you much So sad this one's so mint it's just sitting here just gotta have time to do something with it i think there's another one oh uh, that one's actually not that bad that one not a body man but i can fix that this one old police jeep i think i need the motor somebody stole the clip oh uh, that one it's yeah this one's not too bad needs motor uh, like i said Still got all these WJs that are not in bad condition. This one's not as bad as it looks. That one definitely needs a paint job. I don't know what they were smoking when they painted that thing. Just picked up this one the other day. It's not bad. Oh. I have no idea where that Liberty come from. 
at all. That's kind of scary. I can't even keep up with how many vehicles or what I even have. Wow. And there's more over there. There's a nice Cherokee. That one's not that bad. Oh, I hope y'all are still here. Forgot about one thing I was going to do. Check it out. Bought this thing. I have no idea why. But they're just cool. I mean, who has loves? So, I don't know. Maybe put a 4.0 in it. Maybe put a 2.5. It'd just be a cool truck. And I bought this truck. Really don't know why. Nice two-door. And a Liberty covered up. Oh, I don't even like Liberties, but it's actually a pretty mint one. So, do something with it. Uh, I guess that's it. I certainly appreciate y'all watching this far. Uh, go and go get started on another project.